when I'm selecting a plastic bait for a Carolina rig, I'm looking for one thing. I want a compact bait so I can make a long cast with it, but I still want a bait with some action on it. So when it's down, when I'm dragging that Carolina rig around rock piles, sandbars, or underwater, other forms of underwater structure, I want to have something that entices those bass into biting. I always start off a Carolina rig usually with a Zoom Baby Brush Hog. It's a very compact presentation and with the two kicking legs and then the two wings on the side, it puts off some real nice action. If I'm starting to catch a lot of smaller bass on the Baby Brush Hog and I know there's some bigger bass around, I'll just go up to its larger size, just the Brush Hog. This bait catches some big bass and putting in that with a 5 odd laser trail car extra wide gap hook, you'll be able to get those big bass in the boat. In the springtime, and if those bass are feeding on aquatic animals such as lizards or water dogs, uh, a good bait choice is a lizard. The lizard is a great bait, especially in the spring when those bass are pre-spawn or spawn, because that is a lot of times what is getting around, the, bugging those bass in their beds. So if you ever had those bass that are schooling on top water and all of a sudden that school shuts down, a lot of times those bass are still underneath that area, so a great way to get that school fired back up or catch a few more is, throw, is to throw a Carolina rig shad bait, like the super fluke here. This on a Carolina rig, throw it out where that school was and drag it slowly up along the bottom, and you'll be able to catch a few more fish out of that school, or who knows, you might even reactivate that school into biting. So there are my plastic choices for on a Carolina rig.